and something that's become sort of a tradition for uh, our Easter Jeep Safari workings, we have done another resto mod where we pick a uh, historic vehicle from, from Jeep's past, put some love into it, uh, put some attention to detail to it, and sort of uh, think about it, remind ourselves of, of Jeep's history, but with a more usable vehicle. Uh, we use the powertrain complete uh, chassis steering everything from a brand new Wrangler Rubicon. So it has the two liter turbo four cylinder engine in it. And preparing it for uh, duty for Moab, we added a 35 inch tire on a, it's a Gladiator wheel that we did some special treatment to it, uh, added a two inch lift kit. The rest of the effort went into making this, this uh, vehicle a bit more beautiful on the outside. It was pretty beat up when we got it. Uh, we put a lot of love into the interior and the whole theme is sort of a beach. It's a, it's a we call it Jeepster Beach, but it's a lighter theme than the heavy duty uh, rock crawling theme. It's a very cool car, very unusual. You don't see these around very often. Uh, and it's a piece of Jeep's history that we, we want to sh shed some light on. The interior is done with this beautiful red. There's a lot of bright and chrome on the interior. Notable on the back uh, is this very, this very cool cut back. So it has that slanted back. Uh, interesting, we, we uh, added a tailgate to the back. It's a custom piece that says Jeep. This year we selected a 1968 Jeepster Commando. And the Commando was important because there was the, the CJ down at the bottom end, but the Commando was a bit more special. It had, it had things, uh, a little bit longer wheelbase to it, a different powertrain option group, uh, and special things like doors and roll-up windows and a hard top and a heater and radio, things that were optional or not even available on a CJ. So that is it, the Jeepster Commando 1968, uh, ready for uh, duty in Moab this year.